Hey guys, so you're probably looking at the title thinking to yourself, what in the world is this video going to be about? Well, let me try to explain. About six years ago, I would say, I started this channel and it was about makeup, obviously. And over the years, I started to feel like I wanted it to be something more or something different. And so for a while there, I had switched it to like a news type channel, and that was a huge mistake. It was so depressing, and I don't know what I was thinking. I guess I just wanted to try something different, and I've been interested in what's going on in the world and current events and that sort of thing for a while now, so I tried that, and I didn't like it. So I went back to makeup. But still, I feel like... I want this channel to be about more than that. And I've talked about this before. And I've always been afraid, I think, to do it the way I would like to do it because I don't want to lose subscribers. And I took that chance when I switched it to news. And a lot of you still stayed. Thank you so much. Um, but I lost a lot of subscribers and then I gained subscribers when I went back to it being about makeup again and some people that had left before came back. But, you know, I've been feeling like I have so much makeup and I don't really need or want much more. I don't think I could ever go from buying as much as I have because of the channel for a long time and then go cold turkey and not buy anymore. It's something I'll always be interested in, but I don't want my channel to be just about makeup anymore. I want to encompass other things that interest me, pieces of myself that have gotten lost over the years. Um, I've been listening to talk radio a lot the last few years, and I do enjoy it, and it is very informative and really lets me know a lot of things that are going on in the world. But because of that, I'm not really listening to music anymore. And I've always loved music. I love all kinds of music. And so this morning, sort of as an experiment, when I was getting ready, instead of listening to the local talk radio show that I would normally listen to, I put on a station that played music. And I really enjoyed it. And um, so I want to start listening to music again, or more frequently. And another thing I want to start doing is getting back into reading. Now, I've talked about this before, how important reading is to me. I worked at Borders Bookstore for about two and a half years, and I used to read all the time. I've got tons of books, obviously. There's a bookcase right there. I have another bookcase on the other side of the room and I've gotten rid of many, many books over the years because a lot of times if I read a book, I won't read it again. Uh, some books that I really, really love, I just can't and don't ever want to part with. And I did do a, a video once about my favorite books that I've read, but I want to get back into reading in a big way. I really, really want to always be reading a book. And a part of the reason why I think I've gotten away from it is the internet ruins your attention span. And watching Netflix ruins your attention span too. Because whenever I have spare time, I'm either on the internet or I'm watching Netflix. Or if I read, I'm reading a magazine, which doesn't require a lot of attention. So I really want to get back into reading. It's very important to me. I want to incorporate what I'm reading into my videos. If I'm reading a book, I want to show you what I'm reading, talk about it, that sort of thing. I still will continue to go on the internet, of course, and watch Netflix. But I want to be able to come on here and talk about whatever I want to talk about, whatever I'm interested in in that moment, and make this a more well-rounded channel than just always being about makeup. If I buy something new though in the world of beauty, of course I'll show you. As a matter of fact, there was something that I was looking at this weekend on the internet and 
it's um, something that I've wanted for a long time and I kept talking myself out of it, but I really, really want it and I'm going to go see if I can find it this afternoon and if I do, then in my next video, I'll show it to you. But my next video is going to be about a lot of different things or a few things and um, probably I'm going to talk to you about some of the books that I'll probably be reading next. Now, I know that everybody is not going to be interested in this, and that's fine, but uh, what I'll do to kind of help you out, if you think you might be interested in some of the videos or some of the subject matter, what I'll do is I'm going to put, as the title of the video, it's going to be either Daily Deb or Daily Doll. I haven't decided yet which it's going to be, because the name of my channel is Mrs. The Doll. My name is Deb. So I was thinking Daily Deb or Daily Doll would be appropriate. Then after that, what I'll do is I'll just give you like a hint of what the video is going to be about. Like um, the item that I'm going to try to find this afternoon is a nail polish. So right after Daily Deb or Daily Doll, I'll just put um, nail polish and then maybe I'll put books. So just to give you an idea of what the video is going to, the subject matter in the video, just to kind of help you out. That way, if there's nothing in that title that appeals to you, you can just maybe pass on that one and then maybe the next one you might be interested in. Or if you're just interested in the beauty part of it, if I show you the nail polish first and talk about it, then I move on to books. You can just click out if you don't care about books. So that's kind of what it's going to be like. But there's so many other things that interest me. But there's also things I want to incorporate that would be related to the kind of channel that this has always been. Like this weekend, I bought some new bras. And oh my god. I I know I've talked about bras before in other videos. But these are the most amazing most comfortable bras I've ever found yet. I thought some of the ones that I've talked to you about in the past were comfortable. These blow everything else out of the water. It doesn't even feel like you're wearing a bra. And I mean, who doesn't want that? So definitely going to incorporate that into a video soon. Um, I bought two in two different colors and I think I'm going to go back and maybe pick up a couple other colors just so I might as well wait to do the video and show you what they are. So, um, yeah. So, you know, there's, there's so many things that I would like to talk about and incorporate into my videos and have it be about way more than makeup, nail polish, clothing, jewelry, whatever. Uh, that's another thing. I found a piece of jewelry this uh, weekend at a place that I would never have thought to look at their jewelry. And I love it. So I'll be, you know, incorporating that in. So, They'll still be the kind of things that you've seen before, but I want to talk about books. I want to talk about, I want to go back to talking about Netflix because I stopped doing that because every time I did a Netflix video, I would see that the numbers were really low. But what about the people that did watch those videos that were interested in maybe finding something new to watch on Netflix? So I just want to incorporate everything. And some of it you might be interested in, some of it you might not. So I'll just put like keywords in the title so you'll know what it will be about. But I, yeah, I want to talk about, I still want to talk about makeup, nail polish, clothing, jewelry, beauty items, hair products. Um, but I also want to talk about books, Netflix, um, music, maybe even delve into some deeper subjects, like subjects that I've always been kind of afraid to talk about because people are so strongly opinionated about things and certain things in life are so personal that if you disagree with somebody about something, they get like upset. Um, but you know what? If it's important to you and... What am I trying to say? I'm hoping that if I talk about like deeper subjects that people can be respectful and not like get upset because they might not agree with me about certain things. Like I really, really would love to talk about 
religion and politics and things that, you know, people get really passionate about, but, ooh, I don't know. I don't know. What do you think? Let me know. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is going to be a whole lot of different things. And, um, seeing as how I brought it up and I have it on, I want to show you this. See this ring? Isn't that pretty? You know where I found that? CVS. Now, I've noticed before the CVS has jewelry, but you know, you walk by the display quick and it just looks like a bunch of cheap junk. But this really caught my eye and I love it. It was $7. So, you know, for $7, I really don't expect it to last very long. It will probably discolor or, I don't know, change in some way, shape or form. So basically what I'm going to do is just make sure that I don't put it on until after I take my shower in the morning and that way maybe it will stay looking nice longer but yeah it was it was seven dollars and I just thought it was so pretty it's got um it's got some like interesting detail on the sides and then the color of that stone I thought was so pretty but yeah I don't think it's obviously it's not real silver or anything like that but for $7, even if it only lasts me a month or something, it was worth it because I'm really enjoying it. But anyways, all right, so <laughs> thank you so much for watching, and I hope you will try tuning in to Daily Doll, Daily Deb, whatever it's going to be, and at least just watch the first one and you can get an idea of what you might be in for if you stick with me. So, um, yeah, that's it, and... Uh, I'll see you next time, I hope. Bye.